Hey folks, this is Kalani, bringing you a video which you can use a couple of ways. So, I'm going to be using this for an ectoplasm farming uh, personally. You can use this for a quick bit of profit on the trading post, or you can use this for crafting your own weapons, etc, etc, etc. So, the way I farm my globs of ectoplasm is actually for my in in my weaponsmithing because this gives me the cheapest 70 to 80 rare that I can craft. Now this would be my carrion crate battle axe using carrion because large bones are the cheapest fine crafting material and using a mixture of metal and wood to keep the metal costs down as metals do cost more than the woods in this recipe. So you can do this one of two ways. You can do it the way I do it, which is to craft them, and this usually costs me approximately 14 to 16 silver to craft one carry and crate battle axe. Um, you obviously then can go forward and salvage that for a chance of ectoplasms, 0 to 3, or you can just sell that back on the trading post for uh, a quick bit of gold, depending on how, how long it takes to to sell. I know quite a few of the um, level 80 rares do take quite a long time to sell. I That's why I personally don't throw them up there to sell. It's a more guaranteed profit margin but the time it takes f for me just I, I can't stand waiting for it. So you can either do it this way or you can actually put in low offers on for various level 70 to 80 rare items. Now you obviously want to keep this preferably below 15 silver to get the most out of your um, ectoplasms. Obviously if you get no ectoplasms for a few salvages then you're going to lose quite a bit of, uh, bit of silver or gold depending on how many you're doing. So I'm just going to craft these up. Now I use mystic salvage kits because they are the cheapest to use. So we'll just go ahead and get rid of these four. Now you can see uh, a stack of three. So out of four I got six globs. Now I can either sell these at a bit of a profit or I can go ahead and use these in one of my various crafting professions. Now I personally take these into crafting as that saves me money on the crafting and they, I, I make a larger profit margin off crafting um, actually jewels usually uh, earrings as they are the the highest the profit margin currently it all depends on your market prices so you're gonna have to have a look at your market prices if you don't have the crafting available to take this any further you can just sell these on the trading post for a quick bit of money now one thing to say about this is that it can be quite volatile. You can lose quite a lot of money if this does not go in your favour. I'm not entirely sure if magic finding buffs do help. Um, I usually do it without, as th there's no telling if the magic finding buff even stacks with the 25 chance of rarer materials from the, the salvage kits. So, I don't use them. It, it may help, it may not. I haven't seen any solid evidence either way, uh, but I can tell you that I have created 21 rare weapons, disenchanted, oh, sorry, salvaged them, and got 27 globs of ectoplasm, but another time I have done 34 and got only 21 globs. So I actually lost quite a bit of gold there. Um, but it's lucky that I managed to bring it back up from some of my other sales. So if you're looking for some quick globs of ectoplasm or a way to make a bit of coin relatively quickly, and you have access to either a bit of gold to spend on the trading post to put in low offers or crafting materials and the crafting professions to make some items this could be a, a very nice way of doing it as I say if you do, do not want to take the risk of salvaging you can always sell the items as they are it may take a little bit longer but you're guaranteed to break even if not make a profit it's just a quick video to show you how I have been getting so many globs, I guess, or being able to fund my my crafting videos. So, I hope this was helpful for you. Uh, if you have any questions or queries, please do leave them in the comment sections below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.